So I haven't seen these since I was like seven. So I have no memory. I see this every year. Man, what's your experience this in movie theaters? Like, what would you think? I'm, sure, I don't know. I saw the Hobbit ones in theaters. I didn't really think much of those, but <laughs> <laughs> those weren't very good in comparison. Is Sephiroth back there? <laughs> I don't know. Is so, so the rings like so Sauron just pulled up on the on the porch one day and gave him all rings. Something he took up as a hobby. Like why why does it have to be rings? Like why can't it be like earrings? Yeah, Sauron, this is a potluck <laughs> and you brought rings. <laughs> they don't know I made a ring for myself too. He gives them all rings <laughs> and then doesn't this ring let him control them? Yeah. But the elves aren't evil. And the dwarves aren't evil. No. But the men are. <laughs> Excuse me. Hashtag, Except for these guys. Hashtag not all men. Not all men. <laughs> <laughs> these men are not swayed by jewelry. This was made 20 years ago. This has better effects than The Hobbit. That's... Whoa, video game. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. We can take them. Uh, best two out of three. <laughs> <laughs> And for two and a half thousand That's a long time for the ring to be gone. How long did it say? How are they still in the Middle Ages? Like two thousand years? Two and a half thousand years. Holy shit. Yeah, how are they still in the Middle Ages? I don't know. How is it still Middle Earth and not like New, Mer New Earth City? For five hundred years it poisoned his mind. So basically another five hundred years passes, so like three thousand years just goes by. And they haven't figured out how to make the Nintendo Wii yet. <laughs> I guess it's peaceful, I guess. You know, peaceful isn't the first word that comes to my mind when I hear Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Every 60 years oh later. Oh my gosh. So, <laughs> 3,060 years passed by. Maybe it's because I live in an era where we went from, like, brick telephones to the iPhone 12 in a matter of 10 years. But, <laughs> how even? My, oh my, what a shitty day. Gandalf, that song's racist. You oh. can't sing it. Wait, who's talking? It's me. <laughs> <laughs> I heard your racist song from miles away. I wonder who gave the hobbits this, this much land. Like, the king of Gondor could just come on and, like, hey, I have, I have a war to, like, for all this land. I bought it. Isn't that the plot of Shrek? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All the hobbits go to Shrek's house. <laughs> huh? I'm in need of a burglar, Mr. Shrek. <laughs> what are you doing in my swamp? 1296. Very good year. Almost as old as I am. So what year is it? He said 1296. Plus 60 years, I guess. Yeah. When was the when was the time reset? Because it said it's <laughs> it's it's 3,000 years since uh. <laughs> Yeah, so is this like. When did you start using. Was Jesus born in this universe too? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. Like, was it 3000 AD and then. Now it's 1296 BC? Boy, that one line really messed up the whole timeline, didn't it? <laughs> Maybe if people did try to invent new technologies and they're just like, nah, we're good. And this is a gun. I don't want it. And neither do I. <laughs> Precious. New, more deadly precious. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it making that loud sound? <laughs> <laughs> precious has jammed! <laughs> jammed! <laughs> Who do you think you are, you f***ing hack? Shame on you! Shame on you! Go f*** yourself! This will be us in three movies. What's a movie? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I regret to announce this is the end of my life. <laughs> if you look under all your seats, you'll find a bomb. I'll see you all in hell. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> you know, what's funny is I actually, I haven't watched these movies more than like once a piece. But I've read the trivia about them endlessly. 
So I know like a lot about these movies in terms of how they were made, just not what actually happens in them. Like I know that when he drops the ring here, it doesn't bounce, and that's because the floor forgot to do the bouncing stunt. <laughs> so it's been 60 years since The Hobbit. Are we still on this? <laughs> I'm saying because in that movie, they spent so much time being like, it could be their evil ring. Sauron literally showed himself to me, basically said, what's up, Doc, and flew away back to Mordor. <laughs> like, he's back, it's confirmed, and now Bilbo's found this ring that he doesn't want me to know about. But is it the ring? Sauron doesn't have a body, right? He's mm -hmm. just a big floating eyeball. How is he going to put the ring on if he does get it? Does he just have a little nub <laughs> built into the tower? <laughs> Please place ring here. And then, assuming that does happen, he's still just a tower with a ring. Does the tower turn invisible, or does it just, like, grow legs and start walking across the realm, like, shooting lasers like War of the Worlds? Okay, that would be freaking cool, actually. <laughs> My bowling ball. <laughs> I promise I'm a good wizard. Can't you tell by my interior decorating? And where do you think you're going? I challenge you, Gandalf. To bowling. <laughs> <laughs> we sports bowling. You will never leave until you beat my perfect game. This is what the geriatric ward looks like at the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's scary. That was cool. He didn't even see him come from the other side of the tree. I smell yes. carrots. And cabbages. <laughs> and all manner of vegetables. I hate vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> they remind me of mother. What was that? Mother? <laughs> I hate my vegetables, I swear. <laughs> Tell right. me, how did Gandalf beat the 710 split? Tell me, Hobbits, do you think reminding me of my mother is funny? Hmm? Does it make you laugh to give me trauma? Well, me and the boys here are gonna give you some trauma, if you know what I'm saying. That would make a lovely engagement ring for my girlfriend. Can I have that, please? He's passing into the Shadow World. He'll soon become a wraith like them. <laughs> Wait, what? A wraith like them? Yeah, he's turning into one. <laughs> and he's so small. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious. <laughs> so, Saruman, how comes my army? Army? Yeah, my army, worthy of Mordor. Oh, I heard you say alley. <laughs> and so we're building a bowling alley. <laughs> <laughs> I don't speak that. You've been stabbing a Morgul blade. Now you, now you can hear everything we say. Is that how it works? You get stabbed by a sword, and you can understand a certain language. I guess. We should have that in real life, like Rosetta Stone, but it's like a sword instead. <laughs> you just you buy the sword from the store. It's like German, and you stab yourself in the shoulder, and then you go for a couple days. <laughs> And then you come out the other end like, ah, Düsseldorf, I'm coming on somehow. That's fake German, I don't speak German. <laughs> I bought my Japanese Morgul sword off of Wish. Let's see if it works. <laughs> ah! A couple days later, it's just like, <laughs> yo, Watashiwa, Connor des. <laughs> Or when it's been three days, you can stop making the music yourself. <laughs> it was then. We followed the sound of your da 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 for three days straight. Get her, boy! You're too late. I'm one of them. What is this? This is exactly what my wisdom teeth removal looked like. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> it's October, can't help. <laughs> Mr. Baggins, your medical bill is through the roof. But with your insurance. You still owe us about a grand. <laughs> oh, but insurance doesn't go very far here. You could say it comes up short. There and back again. A Hobbit's Tale by Bilbo Baggins. And then Bomber, the fat one, got into a barrel and... Just pulled out two axes and started killing orcs while we were on the river. It was really funny. 
And then Alfred, the old assistant to the mayor, wore fake boobs <laughs> filled with money to get out of fighting in the Battle of the Five Armies. You were at a Burger King for some reason. I never asked you why, what you had ordered. Did you have the BK have a true way meal? <laughs> With me, you can have a true way every day, Arvin. <laughs> And you can add cookies for a dollar. <laughs> there it is. There's, oh, the there's shot. Ian McKellen. Orlando Legolas, Blue my has Legolas. <laughs> John Reese Day, uh, he's gone. Uh, Elijah Wood is Frodo. Uh, Dominic uh, uh, Horse as Horse. <laughs> Sean Bean as Boromir. Viggo Mortensen as Aragorn. New Zealand as Middle Earth. <laughs> Rock as a rock. <laughs> That's a heck of a voice crack. Rock. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. It's roaring. Just sounds like a burning fireplace. S tier character design right there, Mr. Tolkien. You resisted the temptations. That wasn't tempting, it was straining my neck. <laughs> I know what it is you saw. How did you know? You saw cartwheeling unicorns and a clown saying that he's going to come for you. That's not what I saw at all. I give you the light of Erendil. Our most beloved star. What if I drink this liquid? Is this water? <laughs> I'm not saying you should drink it, but it would be epic if you did. He drinks it and then, like, cracks his neck and then glows like a glow stick. <laughs> hey, that's fungus. Fung toe, toe fungus. <laughs> what do you call a, a foot doctor? <laughs> what do you call a... <laughs> this is what my brain looks like, alright? <laughs> oh, this shot is so cool. I can't believe that he actually almost killed Vigo right here. Oh yeah, because it was... He meant to throw it kind of at him, but he actually threw it at him, you know? My brother, my captain, my king. Frodo's fate is no longer in our hands. But the Fellowship is still in our... Yeah, Elrond checks in, so how's the whole Fellowship thing going? Oh, good. Aaron, I have to be honest, it all fell apart. <laughs> well, first Gandalf died. <laughs> what? Put a bit of a wrench in our plans, I know. Gandalf's dead? But, uh, good news. What's good news? Well, Boromir died. That wasn't good news. I, I forgot. What? <laughs> <laughs> but there is good news. What's the good news? Frodo and Sam left on their own. That's not good news! It's all about perspective, Elrond. <laughs> <laughs> The good news is, you know who's not dead? Aragorn. I'll send the eagles. <laughs> Don't send the eagles, it's embarrassing. <laughs> we didn't fail. <laughs> no, like, this is the definition of failure, Aragorn. <laughs> and off they go. Until Frodo slipped on a rock not five minutes later and broke his neck and died. A happy ending for all. <laughs> <laughs> 